mine is Walter, Angel Face, my office. <laughs> now! Sport is about working together, pulling as one team. Tying up Mrs. Creature is not a sport, Dennis. <laughs> Next week is the annual triathlon against Grey Towers Prep. Our school hasn't won that in 20 years. Ah, but this year we will. Because you three will represent Beano Town School in this year's competition. <laughs> what? Us? Team up? With these losers? Now, now, I want you to prove that you can pull together for the school and make me very proud. Choose a captain and get training, Team Beano Town. You three are the triathlon team. <laughs> I know, Curly, I know. But maybe with a strong captain, someone with talent, charisma, someone like me! There's only one way to settle this. A pie face off. Yeah. Whoever gets the pie will be captain. Get ready, get set, get pie! <laughs> be prepared to follow my lead, loser. <laughs> Operation Dash Landing! <laughs> yes, I'm the captain of Team Beano Town! Woohoo! And I'm the captain of Grey Tars. Hey, no jewels, no Gemma. Our competition. We usually jog up and down Mike Beano's train. I don't think we need to bother. Not now we've seen you, smelly little oiks. Hey, Walter may be smelly, but he's no oik. That's right! But no, uh huh? Oh, looks like the triathlon trophy is ours. Again, little losers. Losers! <laughs> How very dare they! Smelly oiks indeed. I've never been so insulted. And I thought you were pompous. Nobody calls me a loser and gets away with it. Right, we're gonna swim harder, run faster, and and ride better than ever before in the history of the triathlon. Who's with me? Uh, I don't know. Ooh, sounds sweaty. Come on, we can't let them beat us. We're Team Beano Town. <laughs> oh. Walter, you leave me no choice. I'm sending for special ops. <gasps> The games begin! <laughs> Just imagine you've got itching powder in your swimming trunks. <laughs> what? Oh, as if I would. Walter and Gemma, on your mark. Get set. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations to Gemma. First round to Great Towers. <laughs> nice swim, Gemma. One nil to you. It's Jules, actually. 
hang on. You... Hmm? Round two. BMX trial. Good luck, all. Beat that, Beano Town loser. I can beat you with my eyes closed. Time for my legendary triple swing back. <laughs> Triple, Dennis. What happened? Uh, the twins used a magnet to mess with my bike. That's not all. Gemma didn't finish the swimming. That slimy Jules did it for her. <laughs> OK, team. We've got to win the final race. Who's with me? <laughs> Game on! <laughs> Don't open this till I tell you. I'm on to you, cheat. <laughs> I can't go on. Open the envelope now. <laughs> Come on, Angel Bay. Come on, Angel Bay. Come on. Walter needs you. <laughs> Walter, try and remember that what I'm about to do is for the sake of the team. After him, Nasha! Out of breath already. <laughs> Me and Nasha, Rupert's cycling the track, not running it. But we're gonna stop their cheating forever. Listen closely. <laughs> what? Go back the way I just came? <laughs> 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 Hang on, everybody. Grey towers are cheats. Rupert was riding his bike until Nasha Nash the tires. That's a serious allegation. Do you have proof? Yes, we do. Nasha? <laughs> that's the snorkel Jules, not Gemma, used to win the swimming. And that's the magnet they used to make my BMX crash. <laughs> do, do, do let him lash me again. <laughs> I'll tell the truth. We did cheat. <laughs> right, well, in that case, Grey Towers is disqualified. This year's triathlon winners are Team Beano Town. <laughs> Losers. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Hang on, if the competition's over. <laughs> you, oh, give me that! I'm the team captain! <laughs> Not anymore! Not <laughs> Sport of Intel, old chap. Possibly a tad late. He doesn't like double glazing. Or salesman. Just be thankful you're not wearing spotty underpants. Ah. It wasn't me. I wasn't there. You can buy them red and black striped jumpers in any high street. Eh? Colonel? What's wrong? 
There's a bar of two words. First word, spotty. Second word, <laughs> underpants. <laughs> well, at least her dad's not back yet. <laughs> Dennis! What on earth? And now we have to get the whole house double glazed just to buy off that salesman. You can't deny it, Dennis. That dog is getting worse. Rubbish. He's becoming a real problem. Oh. Nah. Boredom. That's what it is. Oh. You don't even know this was Nasha. Could have been rats, mice. He's bored, Dennis. He's got no one to play with while you're at school. <laughs> Something has to be done. <gasps> Dad, you're a genius. Curly, Dad says I have to get a new pet to keep Nasha company. Eh, hey, what? I didn't say that. Meet you at the pet shop in ten. Ha <laughs> 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 Okay, we're done here. The Nasha friendly pet pal does not exist. It's a myth, a fairy tale. A <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Seriously, Nasha, this is the one. There's just something about him. <laughs> Say hello to the Abyssinian wirefin piranha. Oh, Nash proof glass with titanium lead and integral oxygen supply. Nice. What does genius wear, boys? A stripe jumper, jumper Dennis. Ah, there you are, lads. Status report, 1,600 hours. Operation Pet Pal, a complete success. Zero casualties, minimal collateral damage. Oops, bagged and tagged. Two, in fact. Um, great. Thanks, Colonel. Could be time for rations, then, eh? What do piranhas like to eat? <coughs> so, basically anything, yeah? Pretty much. Let's see. The Abyssinian wirefin piranha is almost completely omnivorous. However, <clears throat> under no circumstances whatsoever should this fish ever be fed a... Uh, what? <coughs> pies. As they have been known to cause a... Uh, what? Extreme flatulence. <laughs> Mother, I may have to insist on fewer sprouts at dinner tonight. Ah! What on earth? Okay, Walter, stay very calm. There's no easy way to say this, but there's a hungry flesh-eating fish in your bath. Actually, that was pretty easy. Respect, Curly. Cheers, Dennis. I try. Are you all insane? Get out at once before I call the police. <laughs> There you go. No harm done, eh? <laughs> Once again, Walter, I am so sorry about this. Well, I do sincerely appreciate your cooperation in this matter. And we sincerely appreciate you not suing us without mercy till we end up homeless, destitute and scavenging for scraps in dustbins. Not at all. 
Maybe they can have a moment to say goodbye, though, eh? Don't be absurd. Disgusting thing deserves everything it gets. Chop, chop. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> hey, are we smooth or what? And this year's award for outstanding performance in a fish-themed rescue caper goes to... Nasha! <laughs> nash, Nash! <laughs> oh. oh, no, I shouldn't. Well, I'm sure half can't hurt. Oh, at least you can't escape this time. Long as nobody ever finds out we've still got the piranha, we have absolutely nothing to worry about. Um, Dennis. Just came over to uh, say sorry. Yep, that's it. Right, sorry, Walter. Sorry, Walter. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Um, Pieface. He just wants to give you a really sorry hug. Duh. Get out before I call the police. <laughs> Pardon me, bad pie. Oh, oh, oh that's not oh. you. Oh. <laughs> You are all disgusting. I need to use the lavatory. You will all be gone by the time I come out, or else. <sighs> okay, where'd the fish go? What's up there, Curly? Uh, that would be the lavatory. <sighs> of course it would. <laughs> There's no toilet paper! <laughs> <laughs> to buy toilet paper, and if you are still here when I get back, you will taste my wrath. Oh, nice. I like a bit of soup. Wrath, not broth. <laughs> OK, let's go get that fish. <gasps> OK, we all clear on the plan. Um, catch the fish? I didn't say it was a fancy plan. him every day. Nash, Nash! <laughs> Nash! So you won't get into trouble gnashing stuff when I'm at school. I know you've still got that fish. Sorry, Walter. Don't know what you're talking about. I know it, and I'm going to prove it. You see if I don't, and what I'm... Oh! Oh, 
Yes, yes, yes! Yes, yes! Yes, yes! And now, for the finishing touch. A water pistol filled with bubble bath! What do you think, Gran? I just pranked three people in one go! Yes! Not bad, but watch this. <laughs> oh, you've still got a long way to go before you break my menacing record. Uh, 57 pranks in one day. Wow! Do you carry that with you everywhere? <laughs> Better polish up that trophy, Gran, because I'm going to win it. <laughs> gotcha, Menace! You're in big trouble now! Oh, I'm sorry, Parky. It was me, I'm afraid. I was feeding the birdies. But at my age, my eyesight's not what it was. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, well, that's an honest mistake. Could happen to anyone. <laughs> Very sorry to have bothered you. Bye. That's another reason I'm better at pranks than you. I get away with mine. Uh, <laughs> there he is. Let's get him. Get him. Ah. Get him. Uh, uh, Run. Uh, uh, where'd he go? Uh, oh, well. <laughs> Good disguise, Nasha. How can we beat Gran's pranking record with everyone on the lookout for us? It's easy for her. No one suspects a sweet old lady. <gasps> That's it! <gasps> Come on, Nasha! I know how we'll win Gran's trophy! <laughs> Let's see what we have to work with. Uh, I've got Dad's old suit, Mum's scarf and sunglasses, some talcum powder. <laughs> and you fetched a table leg to make a walking stick. <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> That's... Time for a menace makeover. Oh, hello. Is Dennis in? Oh, Dennis has gone out. I'm afraid it's just me and my faithful dog, Gummer. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, you brought him a pie. How thoughtful. <coughs> Don't recognize me, then no one will. But why? So I can break Gran's menacing record. No, I mean, why'd you give Nasha me pie? <laughs> oh, Dennis. Hmm. 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 Town really needs to do something about those pigeons. <laughs> That's prank number one. Menacing record. Here we come. Good day, officer. And a very good day to you, kindly old gentleman. May I offer you one of my sweets as a thank you for keeping Beano Town free of menaces? Oh, well, thank you, sir. Don't mind if I do. Huh. It's an old family recipe. Extra sticky toffees. Mm. Made with red hot chilies. Mm. Mm. Looks like you could use a drink to wash them down. <laughs> oh, don't mention it. <laughs> hey, another two pranks done. Only 55 more to go. <laughs> Excuse me, son. Huh? Can you help us cross this street? Yes, of course, sir. <laughs> oh, dear, I forgot I need to go to the shops. Oh. <laughs> oh, was I on the way to Bingo? OK. <laughs> Maybe I should pop in to see my cousin Beryl first. <laughs> After I've returned my library book. And visit the optician. And the vet. <laughs> Just stop there. <laughs> oh. oh, and what is the matter?
complaining of this? <laughs> and the fake snake in a can at the supermarket makes 28. Over halfway there. <laughs> We're bound to beat the record. <gasps> and look, there's Gran. And a chance for another prank. <laughs> Oh, I see you like flowers, madam. Perhaps you'd care to take a look at the one in my buttonhole. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Got you, Gran! <laughs> Dennis? <laughs> no one suspects us old people of being menaces. That record is in the bag. Well, I'm impressed. Congratulations. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> ah, the only person who's going to beat my record is me. It is on. <laughs> yeah. oh, excuse me, I think you've got my false teeth. <laughs> oh. <laughs> This menu is far too small. Makes my eyes go funny. We have to do something. These old people are nearly as bad as Dennis. Mm. Oh. Mm. What's that, Sarge? Old folks running a mock in Beano Town. I'm on it. I've matched your record at 57 pranks, Gran. Just one more, and I'll break it. Oh, yeah? Well, I only need one more prank to set a new record. Here they are! Let's get them. What's the problem, officer? I was just out doing a bit of shopping. She's been pulling pranks all over Beano Town. No, no, no. I'm just a sweet old lady. <laughs> <laughs> you better come with me. Oh no! Looks like Gran's in real trouble this time. And there's the other one! Only one way to save Gran. That's right! I'm the Beano Town prankster! But I'm not who you think I am! Dennis the Menace! The one and only! I've had half the town complaining about you, Dennis. You're grounded for a month. <sighs> After all that, we didn't even break Gran's record. Don't be so sure. Huh? But I never finished my last prank. Yes, you did. Your old man disguise was one of the best pranks I have ever seen. On the record for the most pranks in a day with a whopping 58 pranks is yours. Woohoo! <laughs> yes! Oh, thanks, Gran. Well, thank you for taking the heat off me. <laughs> <laughs> Got to start setting a new record. <laughs> Morning, Dad. I made goo. So me and Nasha can go and have a goo-filled balloon fight later. Great, eh? Oh, Dennis! It's school photo day. You have to stay clean. Stay clean? Me? Uh, yes, Dennis. 
I want Mum to have a photo of you looking absolutely sparkling. Upstairs, now. <laughs> Morning, Mr. Um, Walter's dad. Listen, a uh, little favour. You know it's school photo day. Yes, of course. Walter's just had his 13th bath in preparation. He should be clean enough now. Well, after his shower, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, um, I want Dennis to stay clean too. Uh, thing is, I've got to be rushing off to work now. Well, if Dennis goes to school on his skateboard, he'll get mucky. So, uh, could you take him to school along with Walter? <laughs> what, and have Dennis make a mess in my lovely car? Oh, no, 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 no. It won't do that. You're not going to get yourself <laughs> uh, messy, are you, Dennis? <laughs> hey! Me? Get messy? No, of course not, Dad. <laughs> I'm warning you, Dennis. You better stay clean. If Mum doesn't like the photo, you're grounded for a month. A month? Just if I get dirty? <laughs> Well, that threat seems to have worked very well. Have him wait outside. We'll set off soon. <laughs> oh, thank you ever so much. You know, you, you, you really are too... <laughs> ...kind. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dennis. I see you've prepared for the school photo. Rather than smelling of an entire rubbish dump this morning, you only smell of a cow pat. Oh. Oh, oh Dennis, you appear to have some paint on you. Oh, no. Can't out menace a menace, Walter. I'm squeaky clean right now. I know it. No, 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 really. You have some paint on you right to... There. Huh? Ah! Walter! I could get grounded for a month! Oh, sorry, Dennis. I had no idea. You better wash that off then. Oh, don't worry. Dad won't leave until you're in the car with me. You're quite safe. So... <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, right, boys. Shall we... Wait. Where's Dennis? Oh, he's in the car already, Father. Yeah, yeah jolly good. Quieter than usual, isn't he? <laughs> ah, hey, Walter! Wait! <laughs> oh, now how am I going to get to school? Outside any longer, I'm bound to get dirt on me. I can't help it. The only way I'm going to make it to school without getting mucky is if I take <laughs> the bus. The regimental command will love these two ludicrously large and unfeasibly unstable cream ghetto that I can barely keep a hold of. Oops, nearly tripped. Luckily, I didn't. Oh, uh oh, call the menace opportunity ahead! <laughs> uh, I can't resist! Must menace! What's that? <laughs> Thanks, Nasha. If I'd have tripped the colonel, I'd be caked in cake. <laughs> ah, the bus! <laughs> oh, next bus isn't here for another hour. Okay, Nasha. We're gonna have to make it there on skateboard. Oh, brilliant! It's snowing. Nash. <laughs> uh, hang on. That's not snow. That's. Uh oh. <laughs> My 
beautiful gelatos. to get to school on time as if we go through uh, Peanut Town Park. Uh, uh, maybe I was wrong. As long as I stay on the path, nothing can make me dirty. Ladies and gentlemen, yes? I am happy to present the reenactment of the Battle of Beano Town. From the north came the invading Fulchester army who were armed with mud pies. <laughs> Brave Beano Town defenders who were armed with custard pies. Oh, what are the chances? Now watch the carefully choreographed reenactment of Beano Town's finest hour. <laughs> Next to have their photo taken, Dennis. Perhaps I should go next, Mrs. Creature. Something tells me Dennis won't be attending. <laughs> <laughs> what was that, Walter? Oh, uh, Dennis. <laughs> I didn't expect to see you. <laughs> Gosh, look at how clean you are. Yeah, no thanks to you. <laughs> Um, I'm sure this is all just a simple misunderstanding. Um, let's just shake on it. Nasha, Walter thinks we should shake. You know what? I agree. Would you do the honour? Nash, Nash. <laughs> Ready, Mrs. Creature. Uh, all right, Dennis. Smile and arms by your side, please. <laughs> on a timer, your picture will be taken in just ten seconds' time. But, oh, dearie me, I dropped my pen. Well, it's, uh, yeah, well, I, it, it is, I suppose. <laughs> so, no month of being grounded? <laughs> yes! Outside, Nasha! Time for a goo filled balloon fight! <laughs> 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 oh. Our lovely little boy. <laughs> Menaces, 
time for a day off school. Got the stink stench, Curly? She ick. Essence of cabbage, cauliflower, bees' nappies, rotten fish, and ben juice. <laughs> Let's wear this on ourselves, and nobody will want this necklace round. Three, two, one, fire! <laughs> Dennis! Oops. Ooh. Finish cleaning Mr. Detester's car. I even cleaned the inside. The inside? Oh. 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 What's going on, Curly? Let's take a kid to work day. I'm going to a games factory. Avatar analyst. And I'm going to the mayor's office for the day. The mayor's office? You want to be mayor? Not me, Paul. He wants to go into politics. He'll be president one day. And I'll be his official pie taster. Headmaster's assistant, yes! <laughs> A whole extra day in school. <laughs> Beano Town Police Department? Me? Daddy! Jet pilot. Sorry, Angel Face, but uh, uh, mm, under the circumstances, we thought you might suit something a little more outdoors. Uh, how about postal officer? What? Good morning, Mr. Postman Girl. Lovely day, isn't it? it. What is that smell? <sighs> What's wrong with you? Oh, just a deadly Amazonian virus. I couldn't possibly go to work. Cough. Ah, ah, oh, disgusting. <clears throat> All better. Enjoy your day. Aha, they've nabbed the little blighter at last. Ben, this calls for a celebration. I'll get the ginger nut biscuits. Sergeant Tinkle, you get the fizzy pop. <laughs> Trouble in Beano Town. A trouble free day is a good day for a police officer, Dennis. This is so boring. Right, Nasha? <laughs> what? Huh? What? No, oh, Dennis, no. There's no dogs allowed here. But well, Nasha's my police dog, Sergeant. Nasha, Nasha! Calling Sergeant Slipper. We have a situation in Beano Town Park. Roger, on my way. My name's not Roger. Out. Okay, not Roger, out. We're on our ways. Yes! Start the siren! Woohoo! Lesson one. We don't use the noise light unless it's an emergency. <laughs> Hold on! Wait, wait for me! Where's my badge? Constable Menace and Police Dog Nasha. Nasha! What's the situation? <sighs> Sorry. Take a kid to work day. I got Dennis. <gasps> Look! Oh. Ah. <laughs> All right! You, strange hooded figure, put your hands up! <laughs> it's just a garden gnome. It's not even stuck on properly. Amateur. <laughs> Hold on. This is Mum's gnome. How'd it get here? Hmm. Because you put it here, most likely. Right. Let me just get my pencil out. And my pad. OK, where were you in the early hours of the morning, Dennis? No, hang on. No, this wasn't me. I've used my own special formula menace glue. Hmm. It's clear we're dealing with a master prankster. What? It's just gnoming. Gnoming? Yeah, taking gnomes and putting them in funny places. I was doing that before I could walk. Uh... Hey, I always put them back. Urgent call from the mayor's office. Report of a gnome theft. <gasps> On our way! Hey! I was going to say that. <laughs> yes, Mr. Mayor, sir. Mayor. That gnome is a scrimp family heirloom. I must get him back. <coughs> hey, pie face. How's the job going? <coughs> oh, God, it's a lot of work, but I'm getting through it. <coughs> Here he is. Oh, that's just Paul. Hey, that's enough of your naughty tricks, mister. No way for a president to behave. Huh? Slipper! Why haven't you arrested anyone yet? I have a suspect under surveillance right now. Huh? 
That's not good enough, Slipper. What you need is someone who can get into the mind of a master prankster, who, who can anticipate their every move and keep us one step ahead so that we can catch him. Yes, but who? Who, I say? Whom? Huh? Huh. Huh. Oh, right. I'll need my crack team. But Mayor Scrimp, Dennis can't be trusted. He and his friends are probably responsible. Exactly! And if he didn't do it, he better find out who did. And if he doesn't find out who did it, then he'll get the blame for doing it. <laughs> Nash! Calling all units! Calling all units! Come in! Reports of gnomes all over Beano Town. Let's go! Let's go! Dennis, stop stealing my lines. Hey, are you crossing or not? <laughs> Ah, Walter, why don't I show you how to use the PA system? No, oh, gnomes, we're being attacked. <laughs> okay, Sergeant, let's take a look at the evidence. Right, we've sent soil samples to the lab to trace where the gnomes have come from. It'll take up to three weeks. Nah, we've got our own lab. The Abyssinian Tripound Lab. Do these gnomes match all the missing gnome reports, Curly? Well, it appears so. Dennis's house, Mayor Scrimp. <laughs> oh. Mrs. Miggins, Mrs. Creature, Auntie Beryl. Can you verify that police dog, Nasher? <laughs> Mrs. The whole town's been gnomed. Everyone except the Colonel. But he's got the largest collection of garden gnomes in town. Exactly. Time to pay him a little visit. Yes, I heard the reports on my electric radio. So I ordered my men into the bunker until reinforcements arrived. Seen anyone suspicious lurking around, Colonel? Well, only that hoodlum next door. Wait, that's you. Sergeant, arrest this blatherskite. Ah, oh, sorry, Colonel. The blatherskite's with me. Special constables. So, Colonel, we're going to need two of your most able gnomes. Official police business. Oh, right, yes, of course. Ha! Ha-ha! Corporal Tinkle and Lieutenant Sprout reporting for duty. Do me proud, man. We've got a tracking device on this gnome. <laughs> and Nasha will be able to follow this one. Nasha! Time for Operation Oh No, You Don't! Right, everyone, the bait is planted. Stay quiet and still, and the gnome napper will walk straight into our trap. <laughs> Who's the bangers in here? Yes! What are you doing, Colonel? We're on surveillance. Hmm. A medal for supplying rations to a covert operation. <sighs> the gnomes are on the move. <gasps> They've gone to the wheels. Where to, Curly? They're turning left near Mrs. Megan's house. We're about to go fast. Buckle up. And now we saw the road like ground eagles. Follow those gnomes! <laughs> Second gear. Third. Yeah, we're cooking. Oh, uh, is there a cereal bar in the back? It stopped right here. Where are the gnomes? Well, there's Sprout. Oh, where's Tinkle? Oh, poo. What's that smell? It's like cabbage, cauliflower... These nappies? Rotten fish. And bin juice. <gasps> Angel face! <laughs> well, if it isn't Constable Menace. It was you! Pretty impressive prank, Angel Face. But you're no match for a genius in a striped jumper. You're right, Dennis. You are the master prankster, not me. Ah, uh, Angel Face? You? It can't be! That's right, Sergeant. I did it. I'm flabbergasted. Uh, yes, right then. But it wasn't my fault. It was Dennis. He made me do it. Dennis! Right. Come with me. Nash? I knew it was you all along. I've got a nose for these things, you know. Well, you and your nose are going to have to catch me first. <laughs> 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 